Okay, when do you feel lonely? Okay, okay. When do I feel lonely? Um, I find that I feel like very lonely when I'm when I'm really really down, which yeah. it makes sense. But like, um, like when I when I like when I'm depressed or when I like start going down that path, like I'll just kind of like sit with myself and be like, like the thought that there's no one can make there's no one right now that can make me not feel the way I'm feeling like that's yeah. that's when I feel like I'm by myself like no one can get me out of this yeah. that's kind of when I f- like I feel just like I, I'm yeah. the only one you know? and like we've said in the last couple of days it's that kind of realization of it's just us really we come into this world alone kind of through a vagina but then <laughs> but then you leave alone like you're yeah. doing this whole life alone and yes you have partners and friends and stuff but like you said when you're in those like holes or in the really bad bouts of stuff it's only you that can get yourself out of those yeah and that's really really like a lonely feeling and I find that it's I feel fine going through life and I'm like I've got friends to talk to life feels good and mm-hmm. then the moment I'm in the worst patch ever and I'm crying my brain goes I am so alone yes. no one can help me yeah like Which those is, are the exact words that I yeah. tell myself too it's it's, I also find that, like, sorry to interrupt. No, you're good. I also find that I have loads of friends that are like, just reach out, talk to me. But yeah. when I'm in those lows, I just don't want to talk no, to anyone. I don't want to talk at all. No, and I, I, I almost, like, I want to sit in that loneliness. And yeah. I want to soak it up. And I want to... How weird is that? I don't, it's not... I don't even want to get out of it a lot of the time. I just want to sit there and feel crap. <laughs> yes. I, yeah, I know. It's this weird, like... I don't like am I wallowing in it like I don't I don't know actually why I like I don't actually do the things that I know would make me feel better it's just like when I'm when I'm that low it kind of feels like that's reality and anything other than that like when I'm actually happy that's fake yeah but when I'm happy and like things are fine I'm like oh that's distorted yeah. so like I kind of just feel like like when I'm when I'm in it it's just like why would I try getting out of it? Because that, that reality is fake. Like oh, that wow, that's is, interesting. I kind of just feel like, yeah, I just feel like there's no point. Kind yeah. Of. How often do you feel low in your, like, day-to-day life? Um, and are there, are there certain things that trigger it? Yes, for sure. Like, normally, I don't, I don't, like, that's not naturally where I go. Like, normally, I'm fine. But, like, if, if something happens, like, if... I do something wrong and I get in trouble like if anything like that happens I will I just like dive down there like it just it's kind of like instant like I just I just like stop talking and I like I can't even like move my body I just feel like paralyzed like I just like I I feel embarrassed and ashamed and I can't like leave this place that I'm in wow and how long are you in those lows how long does it take you to bring yourself out of them oh I feel like it varies um Usually what helps me, and I was talking about this the other night, um, CBT, Cognitive Behavioral Therapy. Yeah, so Um, explain that again. So, like, you go through different steps, and I think there's, like, maybe five or six of them, and, like, what you do is, like, you, I'm probably saying in the wrong order, but, but you, like, you state, like, what happened, like, what the situation was, then you state, like how you're feeling like what are your emotions and then um rate that on a scale from one to 100 percent like so if like um like someone got mad at me for something like like i'll use driving an example like so i cut someone off so that's what happened and then i'd write like i feel um embarrassed i feel sad i feel like ashamed and i'll like rate them like 90 percent 80 percent you know like i'll up you'll put a percentage and then um think you write like I can't remember basically you do those things and then you start like um you label what your brain is doing so like when I when I say oh sorry let me go back (laughs) so after you write your feelings you write um like 
what were your thoughts? Like what were the thoughts that ran through your mind that made you have that feeling? So I would say my brain told me I was a terrible person, that I am stupid and like should never like drive again. And like, that's what my brain's telling myself. And so after that, you look at your sentences and you write, that's like, you write what kind of distorted thinking you're doing. There's like, you can, you're catastrophizing, catastrophizing, yeah. <laughs> um, magnifying, there's, um, black and white thinking like there's there's a list of all different ones but you like actually put a label on it so you know like that thing my brain was doing is like it's it's not true it's a distorted thought right so after that you um you kind of like you get perspective and like you make a case for yourself like I cut that person off because I didn't realize that, like, they, like, I had a stop sign, or, like, I don't even, I don't, I'm not, like, I don't know what situation we're in, <laughs> but, like, you say, like, um, like, also, like, I haven't been driving that long, like, I'm a new driver, these things happen to new drivers, like, it's just part of learning, um, they probably don't remember that this happened, people get honked at all the time, like, so, yeah. you, so you try and, like, you make a case you for yourself, apart, yeah, they? yeah, and so, um, after that, you rewrite your feelings, and I always find that my my pers- like emotion percentages are significantly lower. So what was eighty is now fifteen. What is like, it, it they drastically drop. Wow. And so when I'm able to do that and like go through that, and it's always like I have to write it out. I can't just think it. Like yeah. for me, I need to like write those words out. Usually that can that can lift me out of it. Um, but it's really difficult when you're feeling that low. Like I don't want to like write a paper right now, you know. <laughs> yeah. So. Um, I usually, like, I told Henry, like, when I feel so low, I need you to grab my laptop, I need to put it in front of me and turn it on, and I can write in my journal. Yeah. And, like, I don't think I've ever had a time where that hasn't helped me. Like, it, That's it's amazing. always is usually, it, it makes me feel a lot better. And such a practical tool for the mind as well. Like, so many other people just be like, just go outside for a walk, or like, I don't yeah. know. I mean, and yeah. those, those are helpful. They are, wrong, yeah. But, to actually address the actual brain and what's going wrong, yeah. I feel like that's so much more beneficial. Right, because we, our brains, like, they get in this pattern. Like, when, when something bad happens, you have these, like, pathways that yeah. would say, like, oh, this is how you're going to feel. This is what your thought is. But over time, like, we can change that. We can change where it goes so that yeah. it doesn't go to, like, you're a terrible person. It can be like, it's okay. Like, yeah. you made a mistake and it's fine. Yeah. Like, so it, it, gives me hope that like someday when I do this enough times and I reteach my brain how to think yeah that I won't immediately go like yeah. down so. do you reckon you will get to a point where you could maybe offend someone or hurt someone accidentally and feel okay about yourself or is oh that way. does that feel so <laughs> way off I mean because I've only lived my life that way I feel like how could I ever not feel those feelings <laughs> yeah but I think, like, maybe I'll have a thought. I'll have, like, a split second where I'm like, oh, my God, I can't believe I did that. But then be able to reason with myself pretty quickly that, yeah. like, I didn't, like, kill anybody. Yeah, like, you're I'm, okay. It's okay, yeah. So I think it's definitely possible, but yeah. it would take a lot of work. 